That's fine. But try to get try to get maybe like a bit of a primer action for um destroy game of December. Probably try to get maybe I'm gonna try to get four in um a four. So you are fifteen questions. So this could be to that could, it could be kind of like a, like a demo of um, Destroy Your Game Assemble, actually, so... So, okay. Okay. Complete the title of this Roddy Doyle novel, Patty Clark. Ha ha ha! Hmm hmm hmm! Ho ho ho! He he he! Would that be ha ha ha? You think it's A? Nice easy one. Yeah. You have 100 euros. Yeah. Yeah, I accept for the commentary. Without commentary, I could probably get to Good. about that euros, euros to find its prop. So, in astrology, what is the symbol for Leo? Ladybird, chipmunk, lion, gorilla. That'd be a lion. You think it's C? Yeah. <laughs> it sure is. You have 200 euros. Yeah. <sighs> Now, oh. moving on, here's one for 300 euros. <laughs> okay. Complete the title of this children's television program, the famous 5, 9, 3, 10. That'd be the famous you 5, which is based on, um, believe it, either Blyden novel the same name. The right answer. And I realized that you for 128, actually, euros. I realized the man did it was uh, Neil Muir did it. Um, he was a guy who had his money stripped uh, 64,000 pounds worth. Answer um, this one. That's my question I have for 250 in the uh, last game. So, what is the capital of Vietnam? Hanoi, Rangoon, Calcutta, Beijing. Would that be you annoying? Think it's a. You bet it is. 500 euros to you. Alright, he's starting off pretty good so far. Remember, you still have all three lifelines left. <sighs> Great start. Here's the next question for 1,000 euros. Get this, and that's the least that you can leave with. Here's the question. Take your time. Okay. Which of these is an Irish snooker player? Ken Livingstone? Ken Barlow? Ken McGuinness? Ken Doherty? Uh, that'd be the nice and world champion Ken Doherty. The final answer is D. Or crap the Ken is known as. Um, I think he's still active on the to tour, actually. Euros, um, you need to get yeah, he hasn't had that much success, really, after well um, his last rank, which I think was the 06 Malta Cup, actually. And uh, I know Doherty reached the finals of, um, I think it was the World Seniors Championship uh, a couple years ago. Um, led 4-0 and then blew it to Jimmy White and ended up winning at 5-4. So... Congratulations to you. You've won a thousand euros. Whatever happens now, you have that in the bank. Have a look at the next one for two thousand euros. You might as well have a go at it. All right, for two thousand euros. Okay. Kilrush is in which Irish county? Sligo, Clare, Roscommon, Galway. Again, a trick I have a lot of these name questions, they go for the ones that have the most overlapped letters. You still have all three lifelines left. You have 50-50, phone a friend, and ask the audience. But I'll go Claire, actually. Have you completely thought this through? I have, gay. Are you ready? Yeah. I was thinking Sligo for you some reason. Your money. Yeah. You have yeah, I think there's, um, I know Tyrone's one I've never seen be a right answer. Um... Let's see. Uh, Ross Gommon's another, actually. And the only other one that's right answer, I think, is Galway. So. From now on, the amount of money starts to rise pretty <laughs> steeply. You are now just nine questions okay. to the one million mark. But if you get this wrong, you could lose 1,000 euros. Take a look at this. I think the record for the uh, most naive questions I've had one game, I think it's four, I think. Um, I think that included the top prize question as well, so... Which sport is played by the New York Yankees? Basketball, ice hockey, American football, baseball. They just won a 2024 ALCS. You think it's D. <laughs> yeah. Ahead. Yep. You now have four I know people didn't like if the Yankees made the World Series, but I mean, it's the first time in, since um, 2009 that it did so. And uh, 
And so that could be the Dodgers or the Mets, actually. People think that if it's Dodgers, Yankees, then Rob Manfred must have it must have it in must have it in the system. You seem to be in good form. Are you ready to go for the next one? Four thousand euros worth. Here comes the question. Alright, halfway point so far. <laughs> Next time I released the song Baby One More Time. Enrique Iglesias, Britney Spears, Sonic, Jennifer Lopez. Oh, that'd be Britney Spears. You think it's B. Onward and upward, you now have 8,000 euros. You're on 8,000 euros. I said before, um, 16,000 is usually Concentrate. the think point where the name question Here bug um, really kicks in. Really. It's, I think, the worst old strand I can think of um, in any game, actually. So, alright, for 16,000. Any Lennox was one half of the Eurythmics. Who was the other? Alex Stewart, Dave Stewart, Andy Stewart, Gary Stewart. But that'd be Annie Lennox and Dave Stewart. You think it's um, I think um, I think the Australian um, it's the right family picture should have the full name actually. Add each family's name. That's how I knew it was Dave Stewart. Um, uh, yeah, I think it's for a thousand dollars. Yeah, Australian uh, family picture edition for DVD. Yeah. So far, on a pretty good streak so far. 24 Remember, in a row without a life. You still have so, all three lifelines left. I did say, you have just and won um, destroy your game December, that if I ever get on a century run during a challenge, I would have to play Remember, until I get a question wrong. Play, so. You can leave now, but we would love for you to win more. Try this one for 32,000 euros. Alright, for 32k. Okay. Who wrote the novel The Debacle? Zoa, Mann, Hardy, Dickens. Let that be Emil Zoa who did that. You think it's Let's A. See. Herbert Mann, Thomas Hardy, Charles Dickens. You needed to get this right to reach. Yeah, I was believe about um Euros. I think it was part of the um right the Dreyfus affair, which Emil Zoa was a chief part of that actually, so all right, 25 in a row of battle life. <sighs> All right. <laughs> Very well played. You now have 32,000 euros. This is guaranteed to be the least that you can win. Okay. The next question is worth 64,000 euros, and you have nothing to lose by answering it. Take your time. It's big money. Here is the question. Okay. We wrote the play The Cherry Orchard in 1904. George Bernard Shaw, Henry Gibson, Anton Chekhov, William Butler E. Uh, that'd be Anton Chekhov then. Yeah, it would be Anton Chekhov. I was thinking, thinking Henry Gibson for some reason. But you were guaranteed a check for thirty-two thousand euros. I'm tearing it up. You won't need it. You yeah. just won sixty-four thousand euros. <laughs> the next question is question twelve. If you get this, you will be just three questions away from one million. You are guaranteed 32,000. You're currently on 64,000 euros, and this one could get you a cool 125,000. Now relax. Take your time. Get ready for the question. All right, for 125. Actually, this is probably the last point where any of questions can kind of mess with me, so... Jerome Napoleon Bonaparte, the last member of the Bonaparte family, died when? 1945, 
1875, 1895, 1912. <laughs> That'd be 1945. You think it's I think this was a $500,000 question. Um, and the so far, Chris Harrison run, game. actually. The crack still goes on. I think, you have just yeah, apparently he, apparently he um, uh, tripped and got choked by his dog. That's what I've heard. Um, I believe in um, either Philadelphia or New York is when it happened, so... And that's one that doesn't pop up too often. I can write you a check right now for 125,000 euros, but I think that would be a shame because you only have to answer three more questions and you win the whole one million. This is the next question for 250,000 euros. Get it right and I can tear up the one I have. Take your time. It's up to you. All right, for a quarter of a million, what you got for me, Uncle Gabo? Mm -hmm. Complete the title of this 1954 Aldous Huxley book, The Doors of Antiquity, Perception, Heaven, Experience. Uh, that be The Doors of Perception, which is about you him taking um, LSD. Well, you could have walked away with 125,000 euros, but you chose not to. Which is just as well, considering you've just won two hundred and fifty thousand euros. And it's also his inspiration um, for the band uh, The Doors, actually. Uh, like I said before, the three I'm kind of concerned with are Elizabeth Taylor, Frank Bridge, and Michael Owen. You I think are it's now just two Rosemond, from one million euros. Viola, whatever happens, you have done and Liverpool. Well. Liverpool, those three. You have two hundred and fifty thousand. You now have the chance to play for half a million. Look at the question, reason it through, okay. decide whether or not you want to play. Remember, get this wrong, you will go right back to thirty-two thousand euros. So, take your time. Here is the question. Okay, half a million. In what year was football's European Cup founded? 1942, 1956, 1967, 1935. Uh, that'd be 56 when it founded. You think it's B. Yeah. They say that yeah, it was, I believe it stemmed from um, Wolverhampton playing um, Honved, a uh, Hungarian, um, Hungarian outfit, yeah. And 67 was uh, lead fanned um, Celtic win via the Lisbon Lions, so. As for this one, because um, Oh By Whom is gone, so 1 in 14 odds. Um, I'm going to go for the bad one, actually. I'll go Abyssinian, which is horse and not cat. So I'll go Abyss, which would be horse, mapped by prediction. You have won 500,000 euros, but we would love to see you leave the game as a millionaire. You have done fantastically well. The next question is all that stands in your way. Get it right, you have won a million in euros. I will say though, I think you I don't have say this in all the games I have. Quit right no one got past um, 500,000. Um, Whatever your decision. Other three you contestants, they all walked away at 500,000. Um, Noel Connor was the only this one the who reached it for one um, million euros. in the Euro. Patty Down, I mean, Roger Dowds, the Pat Corner, did it um, on the Irish Pump Pound. So, all right, what you got for me, Gable? Four million. Which of these is not associated with the Crimean War? Cardigan, Wellington boot, Balaclava helmet, Raglan sleeve. That be a Wellington boot. You think it's B? Yeah, Crimea is associated with it, so. You played for one million euros. John Carver game number one hundred and twenty-nine, and this is the second for today. You have won one million in euros. It's an absolutely wonderful achievement. Well done. Our very best wishes to you. Thank you for a great game. That's one of my favorite uh, post million cues I like to listen to. Um, outside Ken Sparks referencing um, Just Link of Your Beauty in the uh, Australian first edition, uh, Australian edition PS1 game.
Yes, doctors, I am so fine. Yes! That being said, thanks for watching. 